Starting out in 1953, the Abul Khair Group is today one of the leading industrial conglomerates of Bangladesh with a profile that encompasses a multi-business portfolio. The steel production segment of the Abul Khair Group is one of the largest business houses in Bangladesh, having the following companies under one umbrella in a steel segment. Abul Khair Steel Products Limited for flat products. Abul Khair Steel Melting Limited for steel making and billet casting. And Abul Khair Steel Limited for rebar rolling. Being based in Chittagong, which is the largest international seaport in the Bay of Bengal, is a huge advantage for the company in terms of advancing its continuous and impressive growth. This allows easy and cost-effective import of raw material for the company as also export of goods to other countries. Due to close vicinity of the seven sister states of Northeast India from Bangladesh, Abul Khair Steel exports its products to these states. Today, with state-of-the-art machinery imported from the who's who in the international list of technology supplies in place, and a committed workforce of highly trained technicians, Abul Khair Steel enjoys a leadership position in Bangladesh in the production of both high-quality flat and long products. The company's plant for flat rolling uses HR coils as raw material, which are imported from Japan, China, Taiwan and India. The HR coils are first sent for pickling to remove surface impurities such as rust, stains and inorganic contaminants. A state-of-the-art, six-high, twin-stand rolling mill uses these pickled coils for cold rolling. The thickness of the coils is reduced and made uniform to the desired level in this mill. The cold roll coils produced here have very close dimensional tolerance. In addition, the flat products plant also has 20 high Sensimir make cold rolling mills. After cold rolling, the coils are fed into tension leveling lines to improve the shape and flatness of the coil. Rewinding is also done for trimming and leveling of the coil. These coils then become the input for galvanizing. This is a continuous process for applying preventive corrosion resistant zinc coating to prevent rusting. AKSPL galvanizing lines have the capability to produce ultra-thin gauge of up to 0.097 mm thickness as also thicker gauge of up to 2 mm thickness. Along with galvanized coils, the company also produces galvalume coils. The coils produced in the flat products plant are further sent to the cut-to-length sections to produce sheets as per predetermined specifications. The produced galvanized coils also become the input for the company's color coating lines. After passing through the cleaning and chromating sections, the coil passes through the coating section where paint is coated on both sides of the strip. The color coating line has the capability to produce ultra-thin gauge of 0.12 mm to 0.80 mm thickness. The plant uses the latest fully automated machinery to produce corrugated sheets. The flat rolling plant also has profiling facilities and produces profile sheets as per requirement. The flat products plant has a running power plant. Further, to cater to the enormous requirement of power 
to ensure smooth running of the plant. A new power plant is under construction. The steel melting unit of the company is today the largest steel making plant in Bangladesh. The main raw material for this plant is mainly heavy melting scrap and iron bearing products like hot briquetted iron and pig iron. The high quality raw material is sourced and imported from different countries. Other raw material required is stored in silos or covered sheds. Depending upon the grade of steel to be made, the charge bucket is prepared by the scrapyard operator in coordination with the melter. The plant is equipped with two direct current electric arc furnaces having a capacity of 85 tons each. The first step in the tap-to-tap -tap cycle is charging into the scrap. For this purpose, once the electrodes are lowered to strike an arc on the scrap, the melting process commences. Lime and dough lime are added in the furnace during the process. Oxygen and carbon are also added by injectors into the molten scrap. Once the temperature and chemistry are correct, the molten steel is tapped out from the furnace into a preheated ladle. The molten steel is then sent to the ladle furnace for further refining. Required amount of fluxing and cleaning agents are added here. After complete refining, the ladle is placed on the turret of the six-strand continuous billet casting machine. One ladle is in on-cast position, while the other is in off-cast position. Ready to be switched to the casting position once the first ladle is empty. Molten steel starts to solidify while entering into the cooling zone. AKSML uses a high-tech six-strand casting machine which ensures maximum billet production at a time. The produced hot billets are also directly and automatically fed into the reheating furnace of the rolling plant. The 18-stand Abul Khair steel rolling mill is the largest high-speed, fully automatic, controlled continuous rolling mill in Bangladesh. The ancillaries of the melting plant include a state-of-the-art ultra-modern oxygen plant oxygen being a very important element in steel melting. This is the largest such oxygen plant in Bangladesh and also produces nitrogen and argon gas. To meet the uninterrupted supply of power to the plant, the plant has its own substation which takes power from the 230 kV line of the national grid. With a firm commitment towards a clean and healthy environment, AKSML is equipped with an ultra-modern fume treatment plant, which ensures pure air discharge from the plant. To meet the massive requirement of water for running the plant, AKSML has its own water reservoir. The dam also ensures that rainwater is fully utilized for the purpose. AKSML also has its own water treatment plants to treat water for use and reuse. With Abul Khair Steel, quality is a commitment. From production of billets to the manufacturing of high quality end products, no stone is left unturned in ensuring quality first.
but more importantly, the legacy of trust. Earned meticulously over years of fulfilling its customers' expectations, drives Abul Khair Group to reach out towards new horizons, creating excellence with a steely resolve.